yes thank you very much for staying with us once again and for joining us on this channel it's always a pleasure to have you here yes we are in november god has done a lot for us and it is the world cup month yes um 20th of november the 2022 world cup will start the news surrounding the black stars world cup has started already and the ghana football association has announced that look there will be a church service for the black stars there will be an um, um, an islamic prayer day for the black stars and all of that i are going to bring you the details the ghana football association president keto kriku has also revealed deep secrets about the um, president former president of the football association question techi yes and um, we'll be bringing you the details in this particular video and some other black star stories do well to subscribe to the channel if this is your first time watching this hit the notification bell and select or like this video and let me hear your thoughts and comments views opinions in the comment section of this particular video now islamic prayers according to the ghana football association.org or ghana fa.org islamic prayers to be held for the black stars on november 24th the ghana football association declares friday november 4th as a day for islamic worship to pray for the black stars as part of activities lined up ahead of black stars participation in the fifa world cup 2022 in qatar and the ghana football association will visit the central mosque in in friday in accra to observe juma prayers on the november 4th 2022 this special prayer will be led by the national chief imam sheikh osman nuhu Shaributu on friday uh, november 4 2022 executive council member technical and management team of the black stars and the staff of the fa various supporters groups and the general public are all invited now after the 4th of november islamic prayers will be held and then um on the november 6th that's the sunday after they will also go to church and ensure that they have some prayers for the black stars ahead of the um, of the 2022 world cup and that church service will be at the most holy trinity cathedral church in accra right reverend dr daniel sm toto anglican bishop of accra diocese will lead and officiate this non-denominational church service as we seek the favor and blessings of the almighty god for the black stars ahead of the world cup again all executive council members staff of the association across the regions black stars technical team and management committee members will take part in this important church service the gfa is inviting various supporting groups and general public cordially to be part of this solemn events the most holy trinity cathedral is located at the john evans at a mills high street accra near the general post office so 4th of november islamic prayers led by the national chief imam and then the seat of um, november church prayers for the senior national team the black stars you know that also the um, ghana football association and black stars legend um, had the work and then after the work they had a dinner um night on saturday this um past saturday and at the dinner night the ghana football association president was speaking and he said a lot of things one of the things he said was that look um he salutes government for support over the years for the senior national team um ghana national teams from under 23 under 20 ladies national team and all of that look the president says that our journey has been helped massively by political leaders of this country we all know the football association cannot afford to fully finance activities of the 12 national teams but in every tournament ghana has been present and ghana has participated and this is because the political leadership of our country have been very very supportive from the president of our of the land our sector minister honorable mustafa yusuf and everybody in government so he praised the government for their constant support for all national teams and then also he came to the world cup 2022 qualification and said that look undiluted support teamwork qualified ghana to the world cup 2022 and then um, 
Keto Kreku during this particular speech said that look um, when the draw was made and Ghana was supposed to play Nigeria a lot of doubting Thomas has said um, it is impossible for Ghana to qualify ahead of Nigeria because Nigeria has the team has the names has all the quality and all of that and so Ghana cannot qualify ahead of Nigeria but then he had a lot of confidence in the team and he told the boys that look Ghana will qualify and also the whole of Babayara the whole of Kumasi people um, ensured and supported the black stars when they came to Kumasi and when they went to Nigeria also the whole Ghanaians or the whole Ghana um, prayed for the black stars and supported the team throughout the journey and so um, undiluted support teamwork on the field of spirit or the field of play um, on the part of the players ensured that the black stars qualified to the 2022 world cup and then finally he talked about president kwesinyan techi you know that he's the only guy um, football association president of the country who has qualified ghana black stars to three world cups yes um world cup 2022 is the fourth world cup the black stars is going the third the, the previous three was qualified by nyan techi and his team and keto kreku during the same event of the dinner night while speaking to the legends and everyone he said that look nyantechi president nyantechi kwesi nyantechi and his team deserve praise for talking for taking ghana to three world cups and um, i would like to quote exactly what um keto kreku said at that particular event he said that for those of you who have played at the world cup who have many teams at the world cup you know what it means to be part of the special group called the world cup for those of you who have managed national teams to play at the world cup you know exactly what it means to be man to manage football at the highest level of football governance he's saying this let me say are you equal to the former president of our football association president kwesinyan techi he qualified ghana to the world cup on three occasions 2006 2010 and 2014 let's give it to him and everybody who worked with him in those years ghana was represented on the world cup stage are you cool are you cool he said so that is um the things keto kreku said about kwesinyan techi and how he managed the ghana national black stars to qualify for three World Cups, that is 20, 2006, 2010, and then 2014. Except for 2014, 2006, and 2010, we qualified out of the group. And so we will be hoping that Keto Kreku um, and his and his charges will also qualify the Black Stars out of the 2022 World Cup group, so that we see the best for the senior national team, the Black Stars. The countdown is on, and it is very close. It is the World Cup 2022 and all the updates, all the exclusive content, all the videos, uh, all the analysis uh, will be here on this channel, Sport7GH. So if you don't want to miss any of them, do all to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell and select or like this video and do all to leave your thoughts and comments below in the comment section. Thank you very much for joining us and for staying with us for this quick update we brought you about the black stars and the news surrounding the 2022 world cup definitely i'll see you in the next one bye bye